Hey guys, it's Rainy here, and I'm back at again with another YouTube video, and today we're doing another 2K simulation video, and as you can tell by the title, um, I'm going to be deleting all the teams who didn't have a championship, which means the only teams that will actually participate in the finals or the playoffs will be teams that have actually won a championship, because what I did was, um, let's go to the roster. I made every team who didn't win the championship have 40 overalls and I also changed their tendencies uh, so they only pass the ball and don't score. Now the teams are going to score because that's just how 2k works. If you do a simulation the team is going to score in some way, form, or fashion but um, for the most part they're not going to score pretty much at all but um, I can't take them out of the league completely like I can't delete their teams because my league doesn't allow that at least on PC I know on next gen there's a thing called my association and um I'm not sure what it does, but I'm pretty sure you can delete teams and change the roster around or whatever. But, um, I currently don't have next gen, probably won't in a, in a while. So, this is the closest we're gonna get. Now, we have 11 teams who didn't win the championship, so I'll just go, um, over them. The Utah Jazz didn't win a championship, the Denver Nuggets, Minnesota Timberwolves, the Brooklyn Nets, LA Clippers, the Phoenix Suns, the Pacers, the Grizzlies, the Pelicans, Hornets, and the Magic has not won a uh, championship. And uh, let's get this out of the way first. I know my mic's been bugging lately. I don't know why. But um, I am getting a new mic pretty soon. Probably either next week or next month or something like that. But I do know that it sounds like running water in the background. Or I'm, I'm talking through a uh, sewer pipe or something like that. But just know that that will get fixed. It's not going to stay that way forever just the um next few videos will sound like that um i do apologize i don't know why it's doing this but yeah it's doing it but yeah so far we have 11 teams in the league who's never won a championship the rest of them have so we can go over the ones that have won a championship starting with the 76ers next we have the bucks and then the bulls and i'm also not doing it based on who won a championship recently i'm just doing all the time so you know the bulls won plenty of championships when michael jordan is on the team so let's uh move forward the cavaliers have won a championship the celtics have won a championship the hawks won a championship the heat the kings the knicks the lakers the mavericks the pistons the raptors the rockets the spurs thunder trailblazers the warriors and the wizards the rest of them will have 40 overalls on them and the tendencies will be super low they won't shoot the ball like I have their all of their shooting tendencies set to zero their driving set to zero all of that and I put uh, their cold spots everywhere they don't have any hot spots they don't have any neutral spots they have all cold spots so without further ado let's go ahead and sim the season okay LeBron James wins MVP James Wiseman wins rookie of the year and his cancer wins six man of the year defensive player of the year Giannis Antetokounmpo most improved player Chris Butcher and Coach of the Year, Frank Vogel. All NBA first team, y'all can go ahead and look at this. NBA second team, y'all can look at this. All NBA third team. All defensive first team. All defensive second team. All Ricky first team. All Ricky second team. Alright, so like I said, there will be no non-championship winners in the t in the uh, playoffs. So as you can tell, there is no non-NBA championship teams in the playoffs. So let's go ahead and sim the first round. Okay, let's go ahead and win the sim the second round. And let's go ahead and sim the finals. I mean the uh, semifinals. Okay, so the Lakers and the Heat are in the finals. Let's let's go ahead and do this. Okay, it looks like the Lakers are gonna win. Let's just jump in the game anyways. Okay, so there's 58 seconds left in the fourth quarter, and the Heat have the ball. Let's see what Victor Oladipo. I thought he was supposed to be in the Rockets, but apparently he's not. Also, I did turn the trades off. I'm sorry for um saying that late in the video, but yeah, all the trades are off, so none of the 40 overalls can get traded to a different team. Okay, Caldwell Pogba's the ball, passes to Anthony Davis, shoots a fadeaway, bricks the shot, Bam out of bio, takes it up the court. All the deep bow shoots a three, greens it, 101 to 124, 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter. 
Uh, can't come back, bud. Cannot come back. But Caldwell Pope brings it up the court. Passes to Dennis Schroeder. So he does. He does a dribble drive. Shoots a green. Drills it. 126 101 with 10 seconds left to go. The game is over at this point. So Victor Oladipo will probably just dribble out the shot clock. Alright, so the Lakers go ahead and take game one. Let's view the box score real quick. LeBron playing 42 minutes has 31 points, 10 rebounds, 11 assists, and 5 steals, and 4 turnovers. And recorded the triple double in his first uh, finals game. He went 8 for 12, 4 for 6 for his threes. Then a shooter has 24 points, 3 assists, 1 steal, and 2 turnovers, going 11 for 23. And Montrez Harrell scores 18 points, 6 rebounds, 4 assists, and 4 steals, 2 blocks, and 2 turnovers. Goes 8 for 11. Alright, let's look at the Heat real quick. Tyler Hero scores 23 points, 3 rebounds, 4 assists, a turnover. And goes 8 for 12. Jimmy Butler has a sprained left knee, apparently. Scores 22 points, 3 rebounds, 7 assists, 3 steals, 1 block, and 4 turnovers. Goes 8 for 15. Victor Oladipo scores 16 points, 3 rebounds, 6 assists, 3 steals, and 5 turnovers. Goes 6 for 12. 50% on the field. Alright, let's go ahead and send game 2. Okay, so we have a game here. The Lakers are leading 104 to 100 with a minute left in the 4th quarter. Let's go ahead and jump in the game. All right, Miami has the ball down by four. With a minute left in the fourth quarter, let's see what they do. Victor Oladipo gets the ball and dribbles, passes to Tyler Hero, passes to Jimmy Butler, who's still playing with a sprained knee, which is incredible. Uh, Victor Oladipo just surveying the, the court. Jimmy Butler posts up, tries to go up on Anthony Davis, ends up getting fouled. Let's see what happens. Shooting two free throws here. He makes the first one. And makes the second one. 48 seconds to go. The Lakers have the ball up by two points. LeBron James takes the court, playing as point guard. Passes to Andre Drummond. There's a dunk in the paint. Now they're up by four. Dribbles the ball a little bit. Gets screen. Does basically nothing. Passes to Jimmy Butler. Post up again, Anthony Davis. Misses terribly, 25% cover. And he forcefully does a personal foul to Anthony Davis. And um, I think a sentence for mine. I'm not sure. Uh, they call a timeout. The Lakers call a timeout. Player in the game goes to Anthony Davis. 23 points, 10 for 14 from the field. And they forcefully foul Dennis Schroeder, which sends him to the line for sure. First free throw is good. Second free throw is also good. Miami calls timeout, down by six. The Heat passing the ball to Jimmy Butler, goes to a pull-up shot in the mid-range, misses, 33% covered. And Tyler Hero commits the personal foul to Dennis Schroeder, sending him to the line again. I don't know what this is going to help, because I know he's going to make both of his free throws as he makes the first one. And he makes the second one. Okay, and the Lakers dribble out the shot clock, and the Lakers win by eight. So the Lakers take game two. Let's go ahead and do the box score before we go ahead and get out of here. And LeBron plays 41 minutes, scores 36 points, seven rebounds, 11 assists, one steal, one turnover, and goes 11 for 18 from the field, scoring five for 10 for his three. It's going 50% for his three. That's pretty good. Anthony Davis plays 37 minutes, scores 23 points, 10 rebounds, 5 assists, 3 steals, 2 blocks, and 3 turnovers, goes 10 for 14, and 1 for 3 for his 3s. And he got player of the game. Montrez Harrell scores 18 points, 4 rebounds, 2 assists, 1 steal, 1 block, and 2 turnovers, goes 9 for 17, and doesn't shoot any 3s and no free throws. Moving on towards the Heat, Bam Adebayo scores 22 points, plays 40 minutes, has 10 rebounds, 6 assists, 1 block, 2 turnovers, and goes 11 for 15, shoots no threes, no free throws. Tyler Heroes plays 31 minutes, scores 17 points, has 3 rebounds, 1 steal, 2 blocks, no turnovers, and goes 7 for 14, he shoots 50% from the field, 3 for 6 for his threes, also goes 50% from 3, and shoots no free throws. Let's move on to game three. The Lakers is winning the series two to zero. Let's move on to game three. Looks like the Lakers will take this one by a three game lead. With 30 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Let's go ahead and jump in and find out for sure. Okay, so the Lakers have possession and they will pass the ball in to 
Dennis Schroeder. Dennis Schroeder has the ball dribbling. Passes to Anthony Davis. He has two undershirts going on there. I'll have to fix that later. Passes it back to Anthony Davis. He goes up and scores a two in the paint. And the Heat calls timeout. So LeBron James gets player of the game. 38 points, 13 for 21. Not bad. Miami Heat has possession. Pass the ball into Jimmy Butler. He tries to drive in. Gets fouled. Goes up for two points. Makes the first free throw. And he nails the second one. The Lakers call timeout. Lakers have possession. Up by three points. Miami Heat uh, go ahead and personal fouls Den Dennis Schroeder. He nails the first free throw. And greens the second free throw. So now they're up by six points or five points they miss a three and they go ahead and personal foul again and they might be up by seven after these two free throws makes the second one up by six i mean makes the first one up by six makes the second one up by seven okay the lakers will win game three let's go to the box score lebron plays 42 minutes has 38 points, 15 rebounds, 11 assists, 1 steal, 4 blocks, and 7 turnovers. Jeez. Has, he goes 13 for 21, 6 for 9 for his 3, and 6 for 7 for his free throws. Only missed 1 free throw. Dennis Schroeder has 22 points, 1 rebound, 7 assists, 2 steals, 1 turnover, 9 for 19. Oh my god. Goes 1 for 5 for his 3 pointers, 3 for 4 for his uh, free throws. He also misses one free throw. Anthony Davis scores 17 points, 9 rebounds, 2 assists, 2 steals, 1 turnover, goes 6 for 14, misses all of his 3's going 0 for 3, and makes 5 for 6 for his free throws, also missing one free throw. Jimmy Butler scores 25 points, has 6 rebounds, 2 assists, 2 steals, 1 block, 2 turnovers, goes 9 for 19 from the field, 4 for 6 for 3, and 3 for 4 on his free throws, missing 1 free throw. Victor Aladipo scores 22 points, 7 rebounds, 4 assists, 1 steal, 1 block, 4 turnovers, 10 for 15 for his field goals, only missing 5 shots. Goes 1 for 3 for his 3-pointers. Uh, Goes 1 for 2 for his free throws, missing 1 free throw, 50% from the free throw line. Gordon Dragic scores 16 points, 2 rebounds, 4 assists, 0 steals, 0 blocks, 1 turnover, and goes 6 for 16 from the field, 2 for 9 for his 3-pointers, made all of his free throws, going 2 for 2 from the line. The Lakers are leading the series 3 to 0. If they win this game, they will sweep them and win the championship for the Lakers. The Lakers are leading in the 4th quarter with a minute left by 12, 31 to 19. Let's jump in the game and figure out who wins. The Lakers have possession, and if they win, Win this one, they will win in the opposing team's court. They'll win in Miami, and Anthony Davis just takes it in on the smaller defender and lays it up and drills it. Victor Aladipo takes it up the court, dribbles, tries to drive. He ends up passing it to Tyler Hero, and he scores a layup, 133 to 121. Dennis Schroeder takes it up court, passes to Anthony Davis, and Davis trying to Pass the Montrez Harrell, passes the Dennis Schroeder. He gets a screen, tries to dribble around his defender, just stays in place, I guess. Drives, tries to take it up, and gets blocked by Jimmy Butler. Montrez, no, Andre Drummond takes it up for a two. Passes to Jimmy Butler, he gets blocked, he gets the rebound, goes up again, and gets fouled, 91% contested. Jimmy Butler makes his first free throw. I do apologize, someone's probably edging their grass right now on my window, so that's what you're hearing. Jimmy Butler also makes his second free throw, and there's five seconds left in the game in total. As it passes it to Codwell Pope, actually no, it's Brandon Tucker. And the Lakers actually win the championship, goes on to their another championship that they won last year, and... They sweep the Miami Heat. And out of all the championship teams, it looks like the Lakers will be the better championship uh, contenders. Out of out of all the 32 teams, or all of the teams that is left from the cut who didn't win a uh, championship. So, the Lakers will sweep the Heat. And, um, 
on the championship. Let's check the box score. LeBron played 42 minutes, scoring 43 points, so he scores one more point than he played in minutes. Has 8 rebounds, 12 assists, 3 steals, no blocks, 1 turnover. Goes 13 for 29 from the field, 8 for 20 for his threes, Jesus. Scores 19, I mean 9 for 15 for his free throws. Anthony Davis scores 20 points, has 8 rebounds, 5 assists, 3 steals, no blocks, and a turnover. Going 9 for 17 for his field goal percentage, 2 for 4 for his threes, going 50% there, has no free throws. Dennis Schroeder goes 17 points, 3 rebounds, 5 assists, 1 steal, no blocks, 1 turnover, 5 for 15, 1 for 4 for his 3 pointers, and 6 for 6 on his free throws. And didn't miss a free throw. For the Heat, Bam Adebayo scores 25 points, has 7 rebounds, 5 assists, 1 steal, no blocks, 1 turnover, and 10 for 16 for his field goal percentage. Oh, uh, has no threes, went 5 for 6 from the line, missing 1 free throw. Kendrick Nunn has 20 points, 2 rebounds, 2 assists, no steals, no blocks, 1 turnover, 7 for 13 for his field goal, and uh, 4 for 9 for his 3 pointers, and 2 for 2 from the line, did not miss 1 free throw. And there we have it guys, the Lakers wind up winning the championship out of all the championship contenders, or all the championship teams, making them the best championship team by 2k standards. That is it for today's video, if you'd like to go ahead and like the video, subscribe if you haven't already i do have a community discord for youtube and twitch it will be down in the description same with all my other social medias that will be on screen and yeah guys i'm out bro Peace.